Well, it's Holy Thursday, sometimes called Monday Thursday. It is the day of Christ's great commandment. What was the greatest commandment that Jesus ever taught? If you were to take Jesus' teachings and put them into one word, what would that word be? Well, that word is love. In John 13, 34 and 35, it says, I give you a new commandment, that you love one another. Just as I have loved you, you should love one another. By this you will know that you are my disciples, if, if you have love for one another. At the Last Supper, Jesus gave the disciples a new commandment to love one another as he had loved them. And then, prior to breaking the bread with his disciples, Jesus washed their feet. By his actions on that day, he taught us that true greatness is accompanied by loving service and success comes through serving others. You know, I don't say it enough, but I consider it an honor and a privilege to serve you. You are allowing me to do what I love, and you've allowed it for 22 years. And every day I am aware of how blessed I am getting to be able to pray with people, being a writer, which I love doing, and making a difference. It is the privilege of my lifetime. Well, on Monday, Thursday, Jesus gave us his greatest commandment verbally and through demonstration. In Mark 9, 35, it says this, If anyone desires to be first, he shall be last and servant of all. On this Easter week, I ask you to prepare to exhibit your gifts from God, to bless others, to use your special talents and abilities to brighten the world around you. Your gifts, they may have the ability to make someone laugh, you may be a person that is a good listener and you give that gift. Even a smile is a gift. Let us pray. Teach us, dear God, to rise above our former self so that we may live and so that we may demonstrate the exalted state of your love. Humble us so that we may serve others before we seek to be served. Change us at depth so that we can carry a profound love for all others in our heart. In Jesus Christ's name, amen.